I'd like to discuss something that happened very recently. We were doing a uh, segment of the podcast where I talked to fans, people all around the world. They drop, when do they drop? Thursdays. But we had this very strange moment. We were talking to a woman from Westerly, Rhode Island, named Sarah, who's an optometrist. We were laughing about a bunch of different things. And then I just said, what's the worst uh, thing you've seen, you know, ailment you've seen come into your office? Obviously, mostly it's fitting prescriptions, but what's the worst? Has anyone ever come in with an injury? And she said, oh yeah, a guy came in and his chicken had attacked him and uh, poked into his eye. And out of nowhere, do you remember this, Sona? Out of suddenly, yeah. it's the craziest thing. It's like on cue. On cue. <laughs> Yeah. Matt Gorley says, oh yeah, I have a relative. And then you gave this crazy name that sounds made up. Mm -hmm. I know. And it's so crazy that I wrote it down on my desk and it's still here written on my desk. Elmer Elmsworth Gorley. Ellsworth yep. Gorley. Ellsworth. I'm so, yeah. oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't want to mess up Ellsworth. <laughs> yeah. So we're talking to this woman and she mentions something insane because she's an optometrist and she says, yeah, one guy came in and his chicken had attacked him and pecked his eye. And immediately, as if it were nothing, Gorley just says, oh yeah, I had a, a, a relative, a great, great grandfather named Elmer Ellsworth Gorley, whose eye was pecked out by a chicken. And then he immediately holds up a photo yeah. of this guy from 1880 who's missing an eye and he's got a big mustache. Beautiful mustache. And you had the picture ready to go. Yeah. Uh, this was not set up. This was not a, uh, uh, in any way, we didn't do any research. We didn't know anything about this. It was totally random that this woman, Sarah mentioned this, and you have an effing picture <laughs> of Elmer Ellsworth Gorley missing an eye, ready to go. How is that possible? Matt? I've just been carrying it around, waiting for the chance to bring it up. <laughs> that's Finally like, today, it did. That's, that's exactly what it looked like. I pictured you, you go to lectures, you go to restaurants, you always have the picture ready to go. You're always ready for someone to say, well, that puts me in mind of the time someone got their eye pecked up by a chicken. And you leap up and you say, I too, sir, know of such a man. His name be Elmer Ellsworth <laughs> Gorley, and here is his visage. And you hold up a picture. There have been never so happened. many times when someone said chicken and he's perked up, ready to go, and or then it else. Just never. <laughs> or, or else he's somewhere random and he's got his picture ready to go, and someone says, I'll never forget the time my great great grandfather had his eye pecked out. And you're like, here we go. <laughs> by an owl. Uh, you slowly sink back into your seat and jam the wrinkled photo of Elmer Ellsworth Gorley back into your jacket. There's a usual suspects aspect to this where if you listen back to the podcast, you wouldn't know it because it never got there, but I'm always bringing up chickens and eyes. Yeah, sure. You're, yeah. Hoping that you can get, you know, Jessica Alba and she's like, wait, what? Who's this guy talking now? I thought I was talking to Conan. <laughs> Just I'm curious if you have an eye for the chicken, if you know what I mean. Don't you think chickens are so dangerous? Hey, wait a minute. We're, I'm, I'm determined, like any good reporter, I must find out. Why, Gorley, did you have that picture ready I'm to go? so, so hesitant to tell you, of all people, because I just feel like you're never going to let me live this down, but... I can't wait. Okay. I have a band, and I have a song about this man called Eyesore, and I'm working on a video <laughs> where I'm doing this little old 70s computer that does a printout of the visuals, and it scrolls along. And I just know I'm in for it once I've told you that, and it's out now. Oh, my God. I am a very a man who's starving to death, and I've been craw I'm crawling through the desert. I know, oh and I God. just I just oh came God. upon a large what Thanksgiving a large fresh Thanksgiving meal oh. on a table with white linen and one chair, oh. and, and there's a little card there that oh, says no. Mr. O'Brien, and oh. I'm I am gonna chow down. You have a band? What's the band? It's called Townland. And what do you play in the band? I'm guessing guitar. I play guitar. Yeah. Okay. And you wrote a song about your ancestor. What, is he your great-great-grandfather? That's right, yeah. And his name, say it again? Elmer Ellsworth Gorley. And you wrote a song about this man called Eyesore. Yeah. Because <laughs> I guess it's funny to you that he lost an eye. <laughs> well, tragedy plus time. <laughs> <laughs> It, it is while. true. It is true. Uh, it's been a while. How does the song go? 
Are there, can you tell us any of the lyrics? Oh God! Uh, I mean, let me let me think this of this. This is delicious. Oh. This is succulent. Mm. Ta- nah. Sona, taste some of this gourly discomfort. Mm. Isn't it delicious? Mm. Uh. It's quite tasty. Oh, I'm not gonna my. lie. Oh. I usually don't like siding with you, but this is very delicious. Oh my God! Mm. I couldn't have another bite. Or could I? If I know you, you'll be oh. eating on this for years. <laughs> Do you, does the song recreate the accident? Is it like, you know, the song is talking about Elmer Ellsworth Gorley, and then you hear, <laughs> yeah. and then you hear, my eye, my eye. It's all chicken sounds. Do you remember that Jingle Bell song done by dogs? Yep. Okay. You, you seem hesitant to tell us too much more about the song. I'm hesitant well, about everything right now. Will this be available? When will people get to uh, maybe go online and listen to your band? Uh, what's the name again of your band, please? Townland. Townland. Metallica was taken. <laughs> yes. It's out February 22nd, and the album is called Honey on the Hi-Fi. Can we see the photo again, Matt? Can you show yeah. it to us? Yeah, I show just it to see us him again. again. Okay. Oh, oh it wow. It looks like Toby hurt. Maguire with a Kurt Russell mustache from Tombstone. I but mean, I'm not going to lie. He's he's a looker. He's not Except bad both looking, those huh? both those actors uh, you referenced, though, had both their <laughs> eyes. <laughs> I think he was a teacher, a one-eyed teacher. I mean, I'm not. If he was my teacher, I'd be like, "Hello, Mr. Gorley." <laughs> yeah, he was a good-looking guy. Yeah, he's dapper, huh? He's yeah, pretty he's dapper. Handsome. Although, I mean- of course, absolutely, <laughs> absolutely no depth perception. So uh, look at him. Yeah, it, that's yeah. the problem. When you've got one eye, there's just he'd go to put the wedding ring on you, and <laughs> you'd be like, "No, you've got six more feet to go before you hit my finger." Oh um, god! This is. Uh, did he ever opt for a glass eye or a prosthetic? I, I don't know. He certainly probably not didn't have wearing one in this photo. I think back then they just used what was it. They put whatever was available in there. A marble. You know? N- or what, like an inkwell. Or sometimes <laughs> sometimes the hub of a wagon wheel. They just jammed whatever was in there. And uh, uh, people, they'd go into a bar and people would be like, are you looking at me? No, no, that's a wagon wheel in my left socket. It's still 100 years before they come up with the old glass eye prosthetic. Did he wear an eye patch? I, you know, I've never seen a picture of him with an eye patch. I, I would don't. wear an eye patch. Yeah, I would. Do you know too. why the chicken attacked him? Uh, I think it happened when he was a boy. So uh-huh. maybe he was just playing with the chicken. And my, uh-huh. the only thing I've been told by my grandpa was a quote overzealous rooster pecked his eye out when he was a boy. <laughs> hmm. Is that one of the lines in the song? No. Do you want any help with any of the lyrics? Yeah, could, would you mind? It's not too late. The album's done and up and out by now, but we can. Always resubmit. My mind is just bubbling with possibilities. Yeah. I'm trying to think of what rhymes with rooster. How about 200 years before he'd need his Vax booster? He was attacked (laughs) by an overzealous rooster. You can join the band because that's solid. Incredible. An incredible story. And I can't wait for all of you to enjoy this song. Take us into it like a radio DJ. You're listening to KONM Radio, Southern California's only podcast, Great Radio. With your host, Conan O'Brien. All right, well, guess what? That uh, rockin' new band out of Pasadena, Townland, is back. And they have got a new wax platter that we're going to be spinning today. (laughs) This is quite a song. This one's dedicated to Elmer Ellsworth Gorley. And uh, we call this one Eyesore. Give a listen.
I've always had it. I've always had it. 